because we have the medal stadium. It's the rest of the Ethiopian delegation off to an epic race over six and a quarter miles. And of course, in the long jump area of takeoff uh, positions for the long jump pits. But there's going to be a bit of noise over there, which is great. And I think this stadium has been really. The medal in brutal conditions to proud East African nations coming out. Athletics president, Lord Sebastian Coe, and Paul Turgat. What a many epic battles with his great rival and friend, Haile Gabri Selassie. To receive them, Lord Sebastian Coe to give him his fourth neck straining, an iconic moment for British athletics fans and the brilliant Brazilian Joachim Cruz in 1984 in LA. Marathon champion Jacob Kiplimo did his very best to take it, oh, rewarded with a marvellous bronze medal. I'm in Olympic history that Ugandans have shared the podium and it's also the first and a quarter miles. The silver medalist is the world record holder and the world champion, D20. And in one sense, this 10,000 metre race came a year to everything. It's not the gold, but it's the next best thing. He is the Olympic silver medalist. Touch to the heart. It means everything to that guy. And he's got world records, but rest that he can go there to France knowing he's already claimed a medal. <laughs> Salomon Borrega. Adds his name, Mirat Yifter in 1980, Haile Gabri Selassie in 96 and 2000. And Gratian with 300 to go, he was not to be caught. And he creates a little Peter. And still, just the age of 21. tonight you do get to make the take the masks off for the pictures for the one for posterity and you've got to you've got to have the shot yep. with the medals in the mouth you've got to trees that tonight wave so proudly there were still so many in contention with uh, just two laps to go